The Corsi Pro Series is at Las Vegas for the running of the Cobalt 400. On the pole, Marcus Sachi to his outside is Mark Renasato third, Mike McDonald fourth, and Canario and running at the top five, Zachary Fitzwater Sr. Rest of the starting lineup. Pace car goes in. We're ready for some fast racing at Las Vegas. As the green flag is out, here we go in the Cobalt 400. The 46 goes to the inside on the first lap. Here's Zachary Fitzwater running at third early in the race. Now looking for the lead. He nearly won yesterday in the Orbit Minor Series, but a lap car decided his fate as, I want to say, like 15 others too. As here comes Manny Solato now for the lead. The 27. Oh, three, three wide with Victoria Hamill. And they're three wide for second. And now Jorakowski going for the lead. Andrew Miller behind him. Andrew Miller. Now to the inside. Hamill trying to shuffle back in, but there wasn't enough room as Rakowski on the outside. Here comes Eric Bourne in the 15, Benoit Ravine. Oh, makes contact with the 15. Caution out. Oh, the oh my gosh. McDonald. Oh my goodness, is Sam and Oscon's up and over. Arca breaks. Oh my gosh. What are they doing? Okay, let's see what happened. So first of all, there was a crash. As Manny Salato gets into the 14 who got into the 37, turning them into the wall. Mass and Tall getting a bit. Minor series winner Jeff Bright, Mass and Tall. But our bigger concern here is the 46 is he hit hard, spinning like a top. Oh, he got hit again. And then they just, wow. I mean, I guess. Sam and Oscon is somewhat thankful because the people who were just arc breaking in there were flipped them back on all four tires as Sachi got into him and oh he got stuck in the wall. Ouch. Hard hit for Sam and Oscon is and here they come flying in, and that gets him back up on all four tires, so now he can get out. 
to Gustavo Arrocha. And here they come, Arca Brakes. They didn't form an arch with the cars this time, so I guess that's somewhat a relief. But man, Sachi got some air there as Jefferson is spinning. And Code Luigi just threads the needle. And Joe Jefferson, Colton Yo, Muhammad Zane. Abdullah is TJ Hanley's day is done. Roger Ray, Bullet Bill. Unbelievable. Arca Bricks at Las Vegas. We'll take you guys to the start. Oh, we're green. Okay. Eric Bourne, Andrew Miller, the 51's getting passed because he was probably on the inside. And... Yeah, that took out the 7, the 43, the 34, the 24, the 33, the double zero, the 22, the 2, the 09, the 78, the 6, the 48, the 38, the 46, the 37, the 83, 27, and the 21. Wow. Guys, look at this lead pack. Hey, who has a chance at the win? Well, I'll tell you who. Tim Boren, Micro Nasato, J2500 winner Brad Stover, Andrew Miller, Eric Boren. That's it. Here comes Brad Stover, trying to take the lead away from Micro Nasato, as Andrew Miller is there as well. Twenty goes down into the apron. Eric Boren on the inside along with Tim Boren. I wanna know if anyone can uh can catch up to this pack. There's Racer and the four of Joe no, wait, I'm on the wrong, uh, page. I want to say that's Dashboard in the four. Yeah, I'm on the Morbid Miner Series page. Brad Stover now in the lead. He won the Daytona 500. Now he's in contention to win his second win of the season at Las Vegas. Season 1, it didn't take long to get a repeat winner as the person William Carter got their second win of the season here at Las Vegas. Yeah, no, no, they're not going to catch up. Oh, wait, no, the, the 51 is still... On the lead lap. Huh. Okay. And wow. A lap cars again. Nice and tall this time. And look how big of a lead Brad Stover has. As Brad Stover in the 20 leads at Las Vegas. It's not like Daytona where if you have a really big lead then the person can catch up because our, uh, our stricter plates. Nope, he'll probably stay up front the whole race. I don't know, let's see if he gains any time. Uh oh, looks like the 16 is now a lap car. Gets around with no problem. Here comes Dash Bourne, or Tim Bourne. And he's behind the 16. The one lap down, too? No, he's in the mix. Oh, and looks who, look who's technically caught up. Oh, Joe Sandrovich. Oh, makes contact with the 16 and just flies around. Oh, caution!
Jeff Wright's on pit road. Let's see what happened here. Oh, it wasn't Jeff Wright at all. It looks like it was a head. Oof, Arca breaks again. Can these guys, like... I probably need to turn down the panic decel next race, don't I? So, Roger Ray... Oh, wow, the 17 turned up. And that collects the 29 hard hits for them. Victoria Hamill ends up spinning. As watch this, Jeff Wright just comes right in there. Oh my gosh. Wright took a pretty hard lick and... Uh, was I saying Victoria Hamill? Gosh darn it. Madison Tall took a pretty hard hit. But, yeah, Matt, Victoria Hamill was involved in this crash. But now this has grouped the field all up together again, and we don't have a car leading the race by over a second. Here's some new people out. Roger Ray, Jeff Bright, Madison Tall. This will be going green with five laps to go. And Brad Stover's car is... Are they seriously wrecking again? No. Okay. Joe Sandro is in the 18. Can he catch up to his Joe Gibbs teammate as they are, there is five laps to go? No, there isn't. There's four laps to go. Can he gain on his Joe Gibbs teammate of Brad Stover? Three laps to go. He's there. Oh, the caution! Wait, yep, the caution! Stover gets his second win of the season. They just won't stop wrecking, will they? Hmm, more Arca breaks, I suppose. Yepes got turned by Racer and into the wall. Luckily, no Arca breaks this time. Brad Stover wins his second race in the, in the season under caution. Las Vegas. Here are the finishing results. Brad Stover for a second, Justin Drovich third, Tim Boren fourth, Eric Boren fifth, Marcos Yepes sixth, Dash Boren seventh, Zachary Fitzwater eighth, Racer ninth, Macron Hosado tenth, Andrew Miller. Rest of the finish results, Jarkowski, Jonathan Hoff, Nick Nario, and Diego Yepes were all up down, and 21st on down was out. Oops. Looks like you've got yourself in an ARCA break mess. I don't know. But yeah, this race was pretty bad. Victory lane.
thank you for watching the NRL Corsi Pro Series. We'll see you next time.